Hello, this is KD9MED and today I'm going to show you how to connect a Morse key to Morset. Okay, you're going to need some items. You need uh, an iPad with uh, Morset uh, 821 running, a standard power supply, a camera connection kit, a USB cable, some sort of interface, in this case an iPad uh, 2 arcade interface. You can use it with a keyboard or with a standard J38 or other type of Morse code key. Okay, we're going to make some connections now. You want to connect your camera connection kit to the iPad and power it up, of course, with the standard power supply. Connect a USB cable to the arcade interface and connect the stereo uh, input cable to the arcade interface as well. In this case, ground is ground and dit and da are one left and one right for the IPAC2. No configuration is needed to the IPAC2. From there, just connect a standard Morse code key to the uh, stereo input cable. In this case, it's going to be a J38. Okay, now we're going to configure Morset. You want to go to the settings page and from there uh, you want to choose your uh, key in this case we're going to uh, choose a straight key and then what you want to do is you want to enable your uh, straight key and uh, enable that and so it can respond to the uh, keyboard inputs from the arcade interface and let's go ahead and back out all the way out of the settings and you'll be ready to go Okay, here I'm training with uh, CW Apps, and what I've done here is I've chained the sequences together. So every time that I uh, correctly uh, key in a word, it'll keep advancing me through the program and on to the next uh, word to learn. Okay, in uh, quiz mode, uh, you're presented with a uh, phrase to key in, and uh, all you can do is uh, go ahead and try your best to key in the phrase, and then when you're done, just go ahead and enter the phrase, and it'll check your accuracy of your keying against the uh, phrase. You can use Morse to record a Morse code message. Just key in your message and when you're done uh, hit stop recording and it will uh, export the Morse code message as a audio file which you can email. it's a great way to learn a new key. I recently picked up a Lionel J36 lightning bug and using Morset uh, I can actually uh, check the accuracy of my keying. Uh, it sure does make it fun and interesting and you can certainly learn very fast uh, how to correct uh, your keying and make it uh, very efficient. One of the cool things about Morset is you can actually custom define your macros. So here in the screen you can see that I'm uh, putting in a QSO snippet with my own call sign. After I define the macro I can go ahead and label it as well. Once you're done with that, just go ahead and go over to the settings and uh, go ahead and uh, choose the QSO snippets in, in the quiz mode. And then from there, uh, the quiz mode will pick up any one of the defined macros that you just made. I'd like to thank Francis Bonin for allowing me to help him develop this app uh, and allowing it to interface the standard Morse code key. Assistant Cameras by Jamie. 
And Morse at 821 is now available in the iOS App Store. Check out the Paco Labs website for additional information on Morset. 73.